We're going to the Apricot Fiesta this week on Studio 209. Studio 209 is sponsored by City of Turlock Municipal Services, the Stanislaus County Fair, 209 Magazine. Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Studio 209. I'm Eddie Roos, your host, and this week, our very own Angelina Martin goes to the Apricot Fiesta in Patterson, and she doesn't just go there to cover it. Uh, she got involved. You're going to want to check this out right now after a word from our sponsor. Imagine the memories at the Stanislaw County Fair, July 8th through the 17th. The apricot, it's the cousin of the peach and the plum. They originated in Asia over 4,000 years ago. But if you're looking for an apricot today, the best place to come is Patterson, California, where we're at for the 46th annual Apricot Fiesta. Apricot Fiesta has been running for 46 years. It's our 46th annual. It was originally called Hometown Days, and in 1971, we became the Apricot Fiesta because we're the apricot capital of the world. How does it feel to uh, walk around the fiesta with your guys' crowns on and uh, see the little girls looking at you? What does it mean to be an example to them? Uh, it just means a lot because a lot of um, little girls like come up to us and want to take pictures, and it makes you feel like a real princess. I just want to make sure that I'm setting a good example for them so when they grow up, they know they can make the right decisions and stuff and kind of inspire them in a way. Driving into Patterson, I came from Turlock, um, I saw a lot of signs along the road saying apricots for sale. It seems like apricots are a hot commodity in Patterson. What is the importance of apricots to this community? Well, it's huge. There actually is a Patterson apricot named after Patterson. There's a Wesley apricot. There's over 25 different varieties of apricots. And um, that's what Patterson has been known for, for its apricots. Apricot Fiesta, they have an apricot pie eating contest every year, which I'm going to be participating in. And we're here with Michael, who's one of the judges. So Michael, can you just clue me in? What are the rules for this thing? Yeah, so basically it's just hands behind your back, straight going after the pie. You just have to, you get a bottle of water, you get a napkin to clean your face, and uh, basically we have 90 seconds uh, for whoever can eat the most pie. Do you have any tips for me? Start at the edge and work your way in. <laughs> And good luck. We're here with Alec Reed, who is the reigning pie eating champion. Probably going to give you some stiff competition. What do you have to say to that? I'm sorry. Better luck next time. Five, four, three, two, one. Start eating the pie! Look at Alex pie compared to mine you can see that I came up a little short but I did have fun and that's all that matters and Alec I see why they call you the black hole how's it feel to win six year in a row it tasted good <laughs> well congratulations and enjoy the rest of the fiesta I will thank you you're welcome even with the recent rains it's important to remember that California is still in a drought for homes with odd numbered addresses watering is allowed on Wednesdays and Sundays for even numbered addresses watering is allowed on Tuesdays and Saturdays and beginning June 1st watering is prohibited from the hours of 9 a.m. until 7 p.m. for more information on the city's watering schedule and how to conserve water at home visit the city of Turlock website at www.cityofturlock.org that seemed like a lot of fun Angelina except you got a little something right there I think it's pie apricot I don't know I'm just saying just being silly sorry don't forget to check out this episode and all episodes 209magazine.com check us out on Facebook Instagram Twitter and subscribe exclusively at the Turlock Journal YouTube channel next week Studio 209 is going rafting that's right down the Stanislaus River so you guys won't want to miss that one it's gonna be a lot of fun so for everybody here at Studio 209 I'm Eddie Ruiz we'll see you next time <laughs>